Hello, my name is Cheyenne and welcome back to another nail art tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create this sleek geometric look. Honestly, I was looking for an excuse to use my brand new Sassy Sauce polish that I got from Polish Pickup Overstock. This one is called Let Me Ask You a Question. This came out during September of last year and it's really pretty. I love the little black glitters that are in it, but there's also some holographic pigment in it too, which I didn't realize when I purchased it. I was mainly drawn to the high contrast shimmer and the little black glitters. It has pretty good coverage. It's not streaky or anything. I just needed to apply a second coat for full coverage. This polish is super shifty and I wanted to wear it for a day and just enjoy it as it was before putting any nail art over it. So I did put a top coat over it to seal it in. I was so happy to get my hands on this polish along with two others from Polish Pickup Overstock. And luckily they were all from one of the sales that I really missed out on. I love Halloween nail polishes and shades, but at the time I had already a few nail polishes coming in the mail and I was already preparing myself for Black Friday, so it just didn't make sense at the time to grab it. So I'm glad that I had a second chance. Anyways, let's get back to the nail art. I'm first going to paint a line down the middle of my nail. It is honestly a little painful to watch this, but I'll fix this later and I'll show you how. Again, I am using black acrylic paint because I'm just using what I have on hand and the black nail polish I have is pretty low and I'm waiting to place an order of KB Shimmer once I also run out of a clear coat. I'm now going in and adding these triangles at the tip of my nail and this manicure is pretty easy. The most important thing is to try to keep these triangle shapes matching on the same nail and also across all of your nails. So look back at your other nail, see if you need to make it larger or more narrow. And the second hardest part for me today was just painting this line down the middle of my nail. I didn't struggle to paint a line down the middle of my nail as much with my other nails because they had a smaller surface area and my thumbnail in general is just a little bit bigger. So I just had more ground to cover. And honestly, I was maybe going a little bit slow. I think if you, try to paint a line fast and quick. Usually the results are a little bit better, but I hesitated a little bit and then it got wonky, but it's great because then I could show you how to fix it if you're using acrylic at least. I'm going in to make a triangle at the base of my nail to match, pretty easy. I'm now grabbing my dotting tool. As you can see, it is a little crusty of other paint, but I'm going and I'm scratching off the bump in the line that I had accidentally made earlier. So again, using acrylic, much easier than using nail polish. I'm curious who else likes to use a little bit of acrylic every now and then in their nail art. Let me know in the comments below. Lastly, I am gonna go in with my KB Shimmer Clearly on Top Top Coat, my favorite top coat. I did wait for the acrylic polish to dry before doing this and it dried pretty quickly, so I was able to go in and cap it off pretty quickly. And I loved how this all looked together. It reminded me of beetle wings. If you like this video, I do post new videos every single Saturday, or I try to. So I'll see you in the next one. Bye.